Good morning, children. Today, we are going to learn about how to save the endangered animals. It is taken from your Year 5 English textbook, page 83. I hope you remember what is the meaning of endangered animals. It means the animals in danger of dying and not being found anymore. All right, now let's go to your textbook. If you look at your textbook, page 83, there are all together four pictures. Now, we are going to look at the pictures one by one. Let's look at the first picture. What can you tell from this picture? What can you see? You know that a lady is trying to buy something and look at the picture now what is she trying to buy she is trying to buy shark fins and turtle eggs so this is the trading of turtle eggs and shark fins trading means business someone who want to buy why do you need to buy turtle eggs and shark fins? Because somebody eats them. When there is a need for turtle eggs and shark fins trading, the hunting and killing for turtles and sharks will go on and on. And what does it happen after this? It causes the decreasing in the numbers of turtles and sharks. So, if we need to protect the turtles and the sharks, what do you need to do? The first thing, start eating turtle eggs and shark fins. When people stop eating turtle eggs and shark fins, that means there is no need for the business to continue and that's why people will stop hunting and killing for them. Remember, if you want to help to save the sharks and the turtles, just stop eating turtle eggs and shark fins. Let's look at the next picture. From the picture, what can you tell? First of all, marine creatures died. Marine creatures means the animals who live in the water. The animals died. Why did they die? It is because oil spills from the ships. It is because of toxic waste. Look at the picture. The water is not clean at all. If you want to help the marine creatures, what should you do? You need to stop littering. Littering means you throw rubbish into the water. What else do you need to do? The most important thing is you need to stop polluting the seas and the rivers. You need to stop polluting the seas and the rivers. Alright, let's go to the third picture. Look at this picture. What is the man trying to do? He is trying to buy the tiger skin. Alright, what is exactly happening here? This is the trade of animal skins and Tusks. Tusks means the teeth of the elephant. So there is a business where people are looking for animal skins and tusks. Next, the poaching activities. Poaching means the illegal hunting of animals. Look at the hunter. He hunts for animals and this is actually illegal where the government prohibited these activities. Next, 
it results in decreasing in numbers of the animals. When poaching activities take place, the numbers of tigers and elephants decrease year by year. So, what do you need to do? Stop hunting animals. Stop hunting animals for their skins and tusks. The last picture. Look at here. The animals are running away from their homes. Why? Let's see. It is because of deforestation. Deforestation means cutting down of trees. Because the trees are cut down, the animals lose their homes. That's why they ran away from their homes. And please stop logging. Logging means cutting down trees in huge numbers. Stop logging. Stop cutting down trees in the forest. Alright, children. As what we have learned just now, what should we do to save the endangered animals? Now, please read these phrases after me. Alright? Stop eating turtle eggs and shark fins. Stop polluting the seas and the rivers. Stop hunting animals for their skins and tusks. Stop cutting down trees. Alright children, remember, what should you do if you want to save the endangered animals? There are four things we learned today. First, stop eating turtle eggs and shark fins. Next, stop polluting the seas and the rivers. Number three, stop hunting animals for their skins and tusks. And finally, stop cutting down trees. Why do we need to do all these things? It is because we need to save endangered animals from becoming extinct. Alright, you find a new word here. What is the meaning of extinct? It means not found in the world anymore. Extinct means it is totally gone. You can't even see one. Try to imagine this. Your child or your grandchild, they just don't know what a tiger is because they never see a tiger or a picture of a tiger. Do you want that to come true? I think we don't. So, please play our part, do whatever we can to save endangered animals from becoming extinct. And that's all for today. Thank you and bye.